This is the middle of bumblefuck nowhere, man. Talk about the motherfucking boonies. Yeah. Perfect location for a live fire military test range. So this Duke is rich as shit, right? One of the richest men in the country before PKI lost their military contracts. And he collects World War II tanks? Tanks, fighter jets, rare native Mexican folk art. Yeah, which will all be going to the government after we bust his billionaire ass for running guns. Yeah, that's if he believes I'm Jesus. All you gotta do is walk on water, amigo. Tell me about it. You can still change your mind, you know. No, he can't. That train has left the station. No turning back now. All right, how do I look? Like a smug, macho asshole who thinks he's God's gift to women. Yeah, you look beautiful too, baby girl. Damn, mamacita, you look hot in that outfit. Keep it in your pants, partner. Hey, check your equipment. When you're ready, get in the car. Rapido. This is James from Gamefront with our walkthrough of Call of Juarez, the cartel. This is part one of chapter nine. We're out in the boonies. Our friend Eddie's gonna be posing his hazers. Two on the roof to the left. Give me your weapons. How about you give me yours? Seven. Eight. I love that guy's hair. We're here to get guns, not give them away, you see? You must be Jesus. And your restless friend is... Harris. Uh... He's our weapons expert from L.A. Little lady here is helping me with, uh, various things. Is there a reason you brought us out here to the middle of nowhere? Well, indeed there is. 150 years ago, this was a thriving community. A gold mining town. A great example of this country's can-do attitude. But when the mine closed, the town died. That's what money is. The lifeblood of this republic. Without it, what do we have? Nothing. Well, lucky for you, we managed to find my missing money. Your payment is all here and accounted for. Yeah, we'll get to that. But first, I have a question for you. What do you know about the treasure of Juarez? Nothing. Are you kidding me? You are Jesus, right? Jesus Mendoza? Hey, look, I'm not here to talk about ancient history, gringo. We got business to take care of, all right? Yeah, we'll get to business. But first, there's someone who wants to say hello. Amigo! Uh-oh. Oh, what a web we weave when at first we practice to deceive. It's fat version hey, of you soon. from the future, Eddie. How you doing, mijo? You're Harris, huh? You look old enough to have served in Nam. Yeah, I was there. Oh, me too, amigo. What a hellhole, huh? I guess we're both lucky to be now alive. Now that we're all acquainted, maybe we can get down to business. That's what we're here for. I thought we should test these puppies out first. Make sure you knew how to handle weaponry this sophisticated. Originally, I was going to do the presentation myself. But since you brought an expert, let him do the honors, shall we? Hey, come with me, Bonita. I'll show you the way. Oh, come on. Shall we start with this one? Hmm, 
M4, light and precise. Whew, you can shoot the balls off a bull at 300 yards. Help yourselves and take a gander out the window. You won't find any cojones, but we did set up some other targets. Come on now, how do I get my weapon out? one of these shit they're gonna totally know I'm not a weapons oh I got it <laughs> whoops oh come on now should, should I swap it for something else I can't take that huh all right I'll swap it Seems like the same gun. Nice. Let's see what kind of damage you can do. <laughs> Not bad. Mmm, your father taught you well. I want a different gun. I don't want this gun. Let me show you how it's done with the... M260, come on now. I can shoot one of those birds. All right, let's move on to something a little more powerful now. The PKM. Yeah, I'm familiar with it. In that case, I'll dispense with the details. I Suffice thought this is an M260. To say, take down larger targets than the M4. That is, if you can deal with the recoil. Think you can handle that, boy? Do I look like a boy to you, cabron? No, you don't. So realistic. Maybe we should leave the lighter weapons for the ladies. Oh, uh, battery, There's battery! Here that can put some serious hurt on whatever you're aiming at. A bazooka? Harris? Ah, uh, the M72 rocket launcher. Small, easy to handle, and very powerful. Perfect for punching holes in the armored vehicles of the Mexican. Oh, come on! Military. There we go. For chunk. now, you'll have to practice on those wrecks down there. Or that water tank. Give it a try. Oh. As you can see, we have enough ammo to take down this entire town. Right? Am I missing something? I think that is exactly what your father was interested in. I would say so. Then let's move on, shall we? Please, follow me to the square. We're gonna wrap this video here. You can continue watching this walkthrough in part 30 of the Call of Juarez, the cartel. This is James from Gamefront reminding you that we've got the best walkthroughs at Gamefront.com. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.